Now the story. Well, it's been quite a trip for good old Commander Shepard, and for this game it all ends. The Reapers which have been hinted at in the last games have finally arrived and they have taken over Earth, and soon the whole entire galaxy. Shepard is now tasked to assemble an army of different alien races and find a way to kill off the Reapers and save the galaxy once again for the last time. The story for this game, just like the last one, is absolutely brilliant. It's a very powerful, emotional, and gripping tale of survival that easily tops most sci-fi stories nowadays. The characters that you come to know and love are back, along with some fresh faces as well, and the amount of development they give each one of them is absolutely astonishing. It really is. This game's story is amazing. It's amazing. There you go. It's fantastic. So let's go on to the sound. Now let's talk about the sound. The voice acting is plentiful in this game. There are so many voice actors in this game and all of them do a great job. It's easily some of the best voice acting in gaming right now. The voice work for both of the Shepherds, male and female, do a great job and easily have a very commanding-like presence to them. All the other voice actors in the game are just as good. I have to give Bioware huge kudos for one thing. They can actually make Freddie Prinze Jr. sound like a damn good actor. That gets a salute right here. The rest of the sound is also fantastic with the soundtrack being hugely epic and complementing the battle scenes perfectly. I mean the soundtrack is awesome. I would love to have this on my iPod whenever I'm freaking like, uh, I'm, I'm working out like oonch, oonch, oonch. Well that's not how the music is, but you, you get what I mean. Anyway, the sound design does a great job as well with guns, biotics, and explosions all sounding distinct from each other. Overall the sound in Mass Effect 3 is damn good. Now the graphics. It might not be the best looking game out right now on the market, but man does it look beautiful. This iteration of Mass Effect ups the scope of the battles by about 100% in this game, and it is extremely impressive to behold. The whole game is pretty much a war scenario, and it really shows it in the graphics. It looks great. The Reapers are huge crab-like beings that are machines also, so when you are in a battle with one, it gets super intense and really epic to look at. The environments all have a sci-fi and clean look to them, but there is a variety of them, and they all look great. The character models look good as well, but some character animations are still a little wonky looking, just like the other games in the series. Overall, the graphics aren't the best, but man, they do look absolutely great. Now, the gameplay. I went through the other three categories pretty quickly so I could talk about the gameplay the most. The gameplay for Mass Effect 3 is largely the same as Mass Effect 2 with only f a few adjustments here and there. The gunplay is practically the same. It is a third person cover based shooter at its heart and it's a damn well good one. It's very tight and it has its own distinct feel to most other shooters out there which I really like. For example, I hate going from one game to another and already getting settled in with the gameplay because I have played many like it before. Luckily Bioware knows how to make a shooter feel fresh. You also have a set of biotic powers which are great to use when you are either in a tough situation or just want to take out multiple enemies at a time or if gunplay is getting too boring for you. Now the biotic powers are different for each class so pick the one that will suit you the most. One thing that returns in Mass Effect 3 is more of the RPG elements that people missed in Mass Effect 2. Throughout the game you will level up which you could then spend points on upgrades toward your Shepard which was in Mass Effect 2 but here it's like it's more there's more options for you to pick. You will also pick up and buy upgrades for each of the many weapons that you acquire in the game, which is really cool. You can actually upgrade your like damage or your accuracy or whatever, and it's really cool. Along with the shooting of the faces and your biotic powers, you will also be thrown in many dialogue sections, which Mass Effect really is famous for. These dialogue sections are really thrilling and entertaining because they are so well written and you have free range of what you want to say next, rather it be a good response or a bad response. I probably spent at least one third of the game talking to my other teammates or random people that I came across through the story or the many side missions they had you had to do. Bioware knows how to mix fun gameplay with an amazingly well told story. The campaign of Mass Effect 3 will take you somewhere around 30 to 40 hours to complete, that is if you do all the side missions as well, and is highly replayable because of the different dialogue choices you can make and the different classes you can play as. But if that isn't enough, you also have a Horde style multiplayer mode as well. Unlike most Horde style modes in recent games, this one doesn't feel like it was a just a tacked on addition at the last second. It actually feels like it's been worked on and 
you know, been thought of for a little while. You and three of your best buds team up and fight off 11 waves of enemies. They will also mix it up with the occasional objective like kill these specific targets in 30 seconds or hack these computers. It's a fun mode that will likely keep your interest after the campaign is done with. And if you have teammate, you have teammates, I should say, that are actually smart and will work with you, it is extremely fun. It really is. Let me just say this. Bioware, you have easily outdone yourselves with Mass Effect 3, creating one of the best stories ever told in gaming and giving us such an amazing send off to a huge cast of well developed and likable characters. I will say that Mass Effect 3 is my first 10 out of 10 for 2012 and hopefully Bioware will continue the Mass Effect series still after this one. I hope you enjoyed my review for Mass Effect 3. This game is absolutely amazing and should be played by everyone that has picked up a controller once in their life. Thank you and goodbye.